I mean anyone from Georgia or further north. Build your own theme parks. Buy your own sun. Grow your own damn mosquito-infested swamp, pal. We're gonna build ourselves a river. FBI, CI, I don't give a damn. They can't stop us. You shrub. You yellow-bellied, tie-wearing, bribe-taking hypocrite. What have you done for Vice City up there in Washington? I've insured important tax breaks for gun retailers, real estate developers, and I've cut the cost of policing, saving the city 2%, or 25 cents per household, over a six-year period. At the expense of society. Think of the little people. Poor people have no voice in this city. Every time I find a park to meditate in, someone brings in a bulldozer and builds condos. The madness must stop. So you suggest we just stop making babies? People need a place to park their boat and trailer and to put their swimming pool. You're beginning to sound red, and by that I mean you prefer a hammer and sickle over a hamburger. I'm not little. I'm five foot five. It's time for corporations and all of capitalism to step aside for naturalism. You're not saving this planet. You're spending it. Your credit is no good here. We can't afford to loan you any more of our nature. Those are our trees. I only wish I could be around a little longer to enjoy it. I feel so old. Someone must take my legacy. I must train a little me. How old are you? I'm 23, but I feel much older and wiser. I know everything. I've seen a lot of the world. What does the rest of the world have to tell us about how to do things? Build more trains? Have people elect their leader rather than an elite electoral college? Ride a bike to work like a Girl Scout? Or a clown with dietary concerns? No thanks, Vladimir. I'll agree with that. People from other countries are good for nothing. That's why we have to keep teaching them a lesson. I'll tell you what makes a real man. A truck to pull stuff and a couch to think on. I'll tell you. Speaking as a sensualist, and by that I mean a very narrow-minded, id-centered man of peace, and travel. I recently went to Europe. I think everyone should see it for a week. You really see what's wrong with this country when you visit a European utopia. Things like a journey, public transportation, health care, leather shorts, mustaches. When I went to Belize, I helped some villagers clear some land for an environmentally friendly coal mine. We've all got to make some sacrifices if we're going to get anywhere. My dad gave me the money to set up an exciting trust there. But how does that help the people in Vice City from work?